Greetings to one and all. I, Arya Mishra. I, Shifa David. And I, Arhant, welcome you all to our Class 7th Special Assembly. Revolution is an inalienable right of mankind. Freedom is an imperishable birth of all. Labor is the real sustainer of the society. The sovereignty of the workers are the ultimate destiny. These lines aptly describe the struggle of our freedom fighters had gone through. Hence, through this assembly, we honor and pay tribute to them for their enormous selfless sacrifice for future generations. Our assembly depicts our profound respect for those people who gave up everything just to attain freedom. It is not just a meager cup of tea, rather it is a hard-earned treasure. Music is the essence of life. Without music, we are but mere emotionless beings. We are privileged to have so many forms of music in our country. Now let us hear our fabulous singers, melodious but patriotic songs. Wow, I got goosebumps listening to us fabulous singers. Hey, did you know that the first Indian rebellion did not start in 1947 itself? Rather, it started hundreds of years before in 1857 and is also called the Great Indian Event, the Indian Mutiny, Sepoy Mutiny, India's first war of independence and India's first struggle for independence. To add to this information, it began on 10 May 1857 at Meerut as a mutiny of sepoys of the British East India Company's army. This resulted in the rebellion to stop 
and the end of the Mughal Empire. Now let us watch our aspiring actors as they explain these obliterated events of history. I need to talk to the Queen of this region. I have an offer for her. To maintain peace with all, she must give me her kingdom and live like normal people. If she doesn't, she will regret it. Did you see how we were threatened by the British? I can't let anything happen to my country. I have a plan. We'll go into the company during night and attack them all. So, our dear queen, how do you think I should design my palace? It should be as beautiful as this kingdom. This is not your kingdom. Now, I order you to leave my palace without any step forwards towards my people. This is not your home. Go away or we will put you in jail. Ma'am, please change the rule of peeling out animal skin just for a gun. Shut up! You cannot disobey our rules and if you do so, I will kill you. You all work under us and if you try to disobey the rules, you will be out of the army and live the life of hell. But in Islam, eating or putting pork in the mouth is a sin. So please change this rule. I just don't care. And if you try to convince me again, I will kill you. We got a very good thing. It was due to them. The two friends were the Dushman Mandar. I never had the hope of this thing. What are you trying to say? Oh, so I haven't seen you yet. I was trying to say this to say this. That I never even thought of this type of thing in my dreams, where my friends will be against me. So what happens if you are not at our side? You will lose your kingdom. We have even talked to Rani Lakshmi Bai about the same. Hamar Sajita samhavi nahi hai. I don't even think Rani Lakshmi Bai will agree to this. She is like us, a brave-hearted soul who can do anything for her own pride. And as you say, Begum Hazrat Mel, you have time till tomorrow, or else your people and your kingdom will be dead. We will see about that later on. Who will win and who will lose? हम लोग की सजादी की लड़ाई में मंगल पांडे के साथ लड़ेंगे. मैं तुम सबसे आखिरी बात पूछ रहा हूँ. क्या तुम हमारे आजादी के लिए लड़ोगे? लेकिन वो लोग बहुत सारे हैं और हम लोग बहुत कम हैं। Sure you can. Patriotism consists not in waving the flag, but in striving that our country shall be righteous as well as strong. Wow, what a mind blowing and splendid performance! This act portrayed that our freedom fighters influenced us to never give up and continue till a righteous act and accomplish. Dance is the best way to express oneself when words don't work. In ancient India, people danced to depict numerous incidents from the past, give importance on moral values, etc. Today, our talented dancers are going to dance in order to salute our soldiers who self-sacrificed themselves for our nation.
It is not the enactment but the observance of laws that creates the character of a nation. Our freedom fighters have already made our country such a dominant country in the world. True. India has name in the whole world because of these national personalities. Their motivational and relevant wise words continue to encourage us. Long years ago, we made a twist with destiny. And now, time comes when we shall redeem our pledge, not wholly or in full measure, but very substantially. At the stroke of midnight hour, when the world sleeps, India will awake for life and freedom. A moment comes when it comes, but rarely in history, when we step out of the past for the new. India, a much loved motherland, the ancient, the eternal, and the ever new. A reverage homage and bind ourselves to a service. Jai Hind. I don't want to be a man of my own. I don't want to be a man of my own. I don't want to be a man of my own. We will fight so that our coming generations can be a man of our own. Listening to them rejuvenates me all over again. Poetry is the rhythmical creation of beauty in words. This quote tells that we can express our feelings through poetry magically. Of course, now let us listen to Anshika Grover of Class 7A, who has written a poem showcasing her vision for a better India. Hello everybody, I am Anshira Grover of Class 7th A and today I am going to recite a poem written by me on the same theme as Where the Mind is Without Fear, written by Rabindranath Tagore. Where the soul is set free, where the soul is set free, where birds set their wings with glee, where there is nothing to be afraid of, a place where there is no need to show off, peace and glee there is, where time is so slow that there is Nothing you could miss. No drama, no sadness, only karma and happiness. No revenge, no tears left to cry, only gratitude. Not even questions like why. This is a plea, this is a wish, for my world, for my peace. Set my soul into that heaven of freedom, dear Lord, oh dear Lord. Set my soul into that heaven of freedom. Thank you. Jai Hind. Beautifully expressed. Art is the way to express yourself. Without art, life is so dull. 
The purpose of art is to wash the daily dust of our souls. Art is not what you see, but what you make others see. True, paintings are a poetry of sight. As Aristotle says, and I quote, The aim of art is not to represent the outward appearance of things, but their inward significance. Now let us see our young artists' beautiful drawings and how they inspire us. striking lastly i would like to thank all of the students who have participated and all the teachers who have helped us out thank you everyone